Okay, so this is my second attempt to this video, and it's hard when you're in the spirit to, uh, it's just hard for me to talk on a video. I'm looking at myself. But anyways, the thing I want to talk about is the sign of dreams and rapture dreams and visions. Um, I want you people to really think about how amazing this is. So you've probably heard, or maybe you haven't, but God says in the end times there'll be wars and rumors of wars and famines and earthquakes. And and then he says there will be men who have visions and, and dream dreams. Your old men will have dreams and young men have visions. And he says all these things are like birth pains. And um, when a woman gives birth, it gets more intense and more intense and more intense. And it doesn't go backwards. Um and then you give birth. And so the fact that all these, number one, that people are having dreams and over and over. And now every day I look on the internet and somebody new is on there. And I understand some of these might have been four years ago, but I take it all in. Um, these are everyday people like you and me. Some of them used to do drugs. Some of them have been in church their whole life. Some of them work on cars. Some of them are from other countries. They're having dreams of Jesus Christ because Jesus Christ is real and he's trying to um, tell us something. And if you, if you don't get these dreams and visions, it's okay. You know, my heart breaks because we're trying to preach to you. And, um, and I can't imagine what it feels like to want to know, but you're not getting those feelings. But I just hold tight. Um, and I know it's hard to read the Bible, so maybe start in the New Testament, because the Old Testament, I get it. Numbers is very hard to understand the Old Testament, but it's so important too, and, and it's come, a light, come to life again for me and all of us and us Christians, and, and, and for you saints, hold tight, because just hold tight. I know it's tough. Um, I know that's all we want to do is wake up every day and preach the gospel and, and read the Bible more and soak up um, the presence of God. I love you. I'm getting a phone call. But think about that, that um, dreams and visions, think about it. Jerusalem being surrounded by armies, that's two. Uh, all these prophecies are coming true. God is real. And um, I'm praying for you that you understand that. And the reason we tell you all the time is because <clears throat> we know that if we get raptured, it's all going to come to you and you're going to be saved. Um, but we don't want you. We're, I, I pray to God that you get it before the rapture. Get on your knees and just pray and just try to talk to God. Um, I'm praying for you if you're watching this video and your loved ones are praying for you and anybody that you know that is a Christian, they pray for you. That's what they do. Deep down when they're hanging out with you, they're praying for you. And we're all praying the same prayer that your heart, that you, you open every door to find Jesus. Somebody says they want to talk about Jesus and you have that urge to be frustrated stop that urge and just listen with all due respect listen um and if you hear a scripture on the radio or uh, grab it and listen to it and even write it down and say it 20 times in your head that's how we write it in our heart we don't know them all and um and we're not perfect either we are in a battle for you to be honest so i feel like i've I fail, and uh, um, but it's in our heart that we pray. We know Jesus forgave us, and and we're trying to repent, and it's hard. And you have to, and we wish you could just pray for us. Um, 